Scouts. I've been working with Honda for about 12 years. And I got my first taste of Civic um, developing the intake and exhaust for Cabin Sporty Sound um, back on the 2006 Civic Si. Um, what I learned from that development is how important this model is not only to Honda, but also how much joy it can bring to the customers. Um, now 10 years later, working on the 10th generation Civic, I'm very honored to be part of such a game-changing vehicle. As John mentioned earlier, this platform, we set our targets very high. We changed our benchmarking focus from North American mass market to European performance. These targets are used across our model lineup, maintaining them for our four-door, two-door, and five-door, and even into our SI and Type R models. All areas of performance have been improved, but special focus was given to acceleration, brakes, handling, and interior quietness. For the platform, we focused on agility. To us, this means a vehicle that is very lightweight and nimble. We also focused on direct feeling, and that means a good connected vehicle that does what you expect it to. Our concept from this very early on was an Olympic mogul skier. Someone who was confident, relaxed, and very planted that could effortlessly maneuver down the slope, going through obstacles in complete control. With this platform, we're the segment leader for agility and direct feeling. And as I'll explain later, we wanted to amp it up even more for the coupe. Our takeaway from the European study was that we needed great responsiveness high-speed stability while still maintaining a smooth and comfortable ride. This new platform has allowed us to achieve both sporty handling and a high-quality high ride feeling, starting with our LX grade. We continue that evolution, pushing upwards for both sportiness and quality as we continue up through the EX, EXT, and Touring grades. Now for the coupe, as Guy explained, the coupe customer is very youthful and expressive, and the coupe styling is low, wide, and dynamic. To match this, we wanted to keep all of the goodness of the sedan as a starting point, but raise the level of sportiness even more. For the platform, we developed the most sophisticated chassis ever for a Civic, and that covers a lot of good Civics. We've improved the front strut suspension and applied an all new rear suspension that has full independent multi-link design mounted to a new ultra rigid subframe. And for the first time on Civic, we're using hydraulic compliance bushings. These are liquid filled bushings that are applied to the lower suspension arm on all the grades and then are applied additionally to the rear trailing arms on the higher grades that have the turbo engine. This was a major investment but was really key to achieving the premium levels of ride refinement, particularly in the ability to absorbing input from the road into the cabin. Across the platform, we've also applied the all new dual pinion electric power steering system with variable gear ratio. This Civic First VGR system means that highway speed response level is controlled while adding increased agility to winding roads and lower speeds in parking lots. Also, the coupe, same as the four-door, has the same great, powerful, and responsive brake system. As I said earlier, we wanted to make the coupe even sportier. To do this, starting with the LX grade, we increased roll stiffness, applied stiffer aluminum wheels, and increased damper stiffness. Then, working through the hierarchy, we made hardware changes at each level, increasing the performance. So some of the details are shared in the and the document. For body performance, we have a long history of designing cars with great fuel economy and efficiency, as well as being fun to drive. But these can often be conflicting goals, since body rigidity often means increased weight. However, we were able to overcome these challenges with the application of high-strength steel. Honda has been an industry leader in the application of high-strength steel and super high-strength steel for a long time. And we have continued this leadership role with our most extensive application of high-strength steel for a Civic ever. 
we wanted to increase our handling significantly while actually reducing the weight. With our high strength material application and our body development, we were able to reduce the body weight and still increase the stiffness of chassis fitting points. 28% in the front and 35% in the rear. Also, as Guy explained earlier, the coupe has a strong and athletic sporty stance with improved packaging for interior ergonomics. All of this was done while increasing the rear or the torsional rigidity 23% and still decreasing the body and weight, the body and white weight by 76 pounds. Also, we increased body sealing 75% and improved aero by dropping the CD on over 12%. Later today when you drive the car, I'm sure you'll be able to feel its quick handling and more nimble and quiet driving experience. Now I'd like to talk a little bit about our safety technologies. Honda has a long history of targeting and achieving the highest level of safety in the industry. In order to maintain our industry leading position, we've applied our latest generation of ACE body structure and extensive high strength steels. The body structure has a lot of technologies applied to keep the customer safe, but we would prefer that no one actually has an accident. So we're very excited to have made our full suite of Honda assisting technologies available on the coupe. And for the first time, ACC with low speed follow will be available, a first in this segment. This allows the driver to set the distance they are comfortable with and the vehicle <coughs> will adapt to the vehicle ahead of it all the way down to a complete stop. This reduces driver fatigue and prevents fender benders in conditions like LA traffic. With all of these active and passive safety features, once again, Honda has positioned itself as an industry leader in safety. The sedan has already received IIHS Top Safety Pick Plus, and based on our testing, we anticipate NHTSA 5 Star and Top Safety Pick Plus for the coupe as well. So I'm really proud of what we've accomplished with this Civic. We've made a car with no compromises. It's efficient, safe, and fun to drive. So